Hello everyone and welcome back to another Sunday Sunshine Show. This week I'd like to welcome Amanda. Amanda is our guest. I will put Amanda's channel in the description box for you down below and I'll also put it on the screen here for you now. Uh, today's, well, this week's challenge is a thrift stroke charity shop challenge to spend up to a maximum of £30 to go and find some goodies. So I come to Simon Sester, uh, which is in the Cotswolds, and I know they've got several charity shops here, so I'm going to have a look round, so it's just myself and my husband. Uh, so I'm going to have a look and see what we can find, and I'm going to take you along with me. So it's a glorious sunny day. Michael's just gone to get the car ticket. Uh, I don't know how long this sun's going to last, but we have had a lot of rain, well, rain every day for months now. So hopefully... It's going to be a dry day. Well, Michael's with me. We're going to go and have a look. We found our first charity shop to see what we can find. So this is the one Michael's gone on in. Let's go and see what we can find. I always find they do nice window displays, don't they, charity shops? Oh, that's a lovely little handbag. £20. That's rather cute. Let's have a look inside. So I've just found Mr. Bear, £4.50, my first find. Just found these gorgeous little crystals, can you see? So pretty, that little engine. i just got no way to put them, unfortunately, but they are gorgeous. Right, let's have another look, see what else we can find. So some good finds in that shop. So just have a quick walk down the high street and find the next one. If you haven't been to Simon Sester in the Cotswolds, it's a beautiful place. That lovely cathedral. And we're here, it's Saturday morning, and it's quarter to ten. And it's lovely and quiet, definitely the best time to come. Find another one, Oxfam. Let's go and have a look in here. And this is a bookshop. So many books. So many books. A pop up book of phobias, £40. Wow. Okay, we found another one, the Blue Cross. So we go and have a look, see what they've got in here. Okay, Blue Cross for pets. Again, a lovely window display. You can see, look at that dress and hat. Those nice beach bags. That blue one's nice, isn't it? Got some blue shoes. Cat kitchen bag. Right, we're going to have a look inside. Oh, I absolutely love this olive tree. £25. Shall I? That is lovely, look, it's got olives on as well. That pink shirt's quite nice. Is that one? Five pounds. <coughs> Helen and Douglas House. Children's Hospice. Let's have a look in here. So now we've got the British Heart Foundation. 
There's a fuss there. So if you want the hat for a wedding or anything, charity shops are definitely a place to go. Okay. Let me go to see what they've got inside. Quite like that one. Yeah, that's like his auntie one, isn't it? <coughs> they really did the displays nice, don't they? That's quite nice, isn't it? Yes, it's pale. Nice thick one. <laughs> Yeah, so I hope you enjoyed that little look in the charity shops in Simoncester. Uh, Simoncester is the capital of the Cotswolds and it's a lovely little town. So if you get a chance to visit it, then, you know, it is wonderful. But there's so many charity shops there. We only went in a few. There's absolutely loads. I definitely want to go back again and explore some more. There are so many different charity shops. And I was impressed, I must admit, I think I saw some nice things. I really did like the olive tree. I really wish I picked it up. I didn't, but I may have to go back next week to get that one, if it's still there. But what I did pick up was this bear, and this was from Next. And as I say, £4.50. He sat reading his book. Isn't he lovely? His little little soft spots on the bottom so yeah I'm going to find a home for him and he was brand new £4.50 I picked up the bag the leather handbag that we saw and I think this was was it £7? let's have a look at the tag yeah £7 so it's a nice soft leather crossbody bag got the zip on the front you've got the, the big zip there and pocket and there's also a pocket on the back so I thought that's ideal for summer and then I picked this up thinking it was a lunch box and I thought oh it was great but when I got home <laughs> and it actually says on the label it's a travel bag £6.50 travel bag I didn't see that I really thought it was a lunchbox but anyway it's a travel bag so I'm sure I'll get lots of use out of it if I open it up it's got the little hanging hook here it's brand new and you've got all these compartments so you can hang it up there's one at the bottom of the zip so yeah put me makeup in there me toiletries me medication that would be really good, wouldn't it, sort of to take away anywhere. Yeah, so I didn't realise what I thought was a lunchbox. It's a travel bag. But it's lovely, isn't it? So, yeah, that's what I picked up. But, yeah, I love Mr Bear here. So, let me show you where I'm going to put him. Yeah, so I think he looks quite nice here. That's where he's going to sit for now. That's my heating thermostat. He looks nice and chilled, doesn't he? Relax there. Yeah, so please take a look at Amanda's channel. So it's a Amanda Oak Inks. I will put it in the description box. And she's a lovely lady. She does lots of um, home hauls and cleaning and bits and pieces to her house. I really... I've just started watching her and I really enjoy watching her she's got a lovely voice she really has and then please take a look at the other ladies channels the other housewives you Tina from Tina's Talk Time Karen and Georgie Grandma and Marie Busy Bee Marie and I will see you all very soon in the next one goodbye everyone bye mm -hmm.